This is James Mack, Regional Sales Manager with McCormick Systems. And in today's video, I'm going to show you how to combine both our Auto Count and Auto Home Run features. Once you've opened a sheet in Design Estimating Pro, go ahead and set your scale. And now we are ready to start counting. I've gone ahead and preset an endpoint to run all our cable back to. Now we'll go ahead and count all of our data outlets and have our runs go automatically back to our data rack. First, define the search area. Make sure we've selected the part we want to count. Define criteria by simply drawing a box, left-clicking and dragging around the symbol. And now go ahead and click your Add Search button. Once the search is complete, we can review the results. I like to start by selecting the Check All box. Then scroll down to filter out any symbols that we don't wish to count. Next, go into your parts and route details to choose your linear item or assembly. You can pull from your hot list, your database, or your favorites list. Let's choose a route type. We'll select an endpoint and a route path. Go ahead and hit accept takeoff. And now the program is auto counting and automatically applying the run back to, in this case, the data rack. And if we look at our legend over here on the left, we'll see that in a matter of seconds, the program counted all 34 jacks or outlets, as well as accounted for almost 3,700 feet of cable. And that's how we combined auto home run with auto count. Thank you for viewing today. To see more of McCormick Systems, you can schedule a personal demonstration by clicking on the scheduled demo link or call us at the number on your screen.